What's going on guys and welcome to another video. Today we're going to be taking a look at some more unreleased outfits for the US, UK, and German factions. If you happen to go take a look at Temporial's page, he released some more outfits, but if you didn't, here's a quick look at them. Now, before we get into this guys, just keep in mind that even though these outfits do look complete and ready to go, there's a possibility that these might not even make it to the game. Also, be sure to stop by Temporial's page as he puts in hard work to bring this information to us, so go give him a follow and show him your support, but let's get into it. Starting off with one of my favorites, a ghillie suit variant for the Germans. This again looks great and DICE did a great job with this and it reminds me a lot of the sniper from the movie Fury if any of you remember. This outfit is highly detailed and is obviously the first of its kind for the German factions. I'm sure this outfit will be popular amongst many people if it ever does get released and I hope it does. It blends in well with the Twisted Steel or Arras maps. But moving on to another German outfit. I definitely cannot pronounce the name of this, but these were the first German paratrooper outfits in large scale operations. Just by the information that Temporal shared with us, these were nicknamed the Green Devils. Even though this outfit has certain pieces that clearly is a copy and paste from other outfits such as the hat and pants, just different colors, I think the chest piece is the main detailed point in this outfit. All in all guys, I hope this one comes to light and we're able to obtain this in the future. It would be great for mixing and matching with other outfits. Now moving on to the Mustang and Werewolf outfits for the German and US. This German outfit is something that we would have seen a long time ago if the 5v5 competitive game mode wasn't cancelled. This was a class character model that you would spawn in as, but since that was cancelled, it looks like DICE made it as an outfit to be hopefully obtained in the future. And if it does release, it's really cool in my opinion with the transceiver box on the chest piece. Now, for the Mustang outfit, I find this one interesting and it'll be the first pilot outfit for the US that you can actually customize. It seems more and more unreleased outfits that are coming, they actually come with gloves that you can see in game. A cool little addition, in my opinion. But let's move on to the last two outfits, the Cavalry Commando and the Wooston Corps. I'm definitely pronouncing that wrong, so I do apologize guys. But here is another new UK outfit, and in my opinion, it looks awesome. And I really like the beret and the detail on the chest piece itself. Everything blends so good with this outfit, and for once, DICE is color coordinated with this. Now as for the German outfit, this may look a little bland and less detailed than others, but this will be the first for these Germans to have shorts as a cosmetic, and that hat though. But all in all guys, I think all the outfits, like I've said before, would be great additions to the game and please many people, and I really do hope that these can be obtainable as time goes on. Just keep in mind guys, these were data mined and they might not even make it to the game in general, but let's just hope for the best. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed a look at these unreleased outfits. It's a shame that it took this long for them to please the community with great outfits like these, or at least excite people. But as always guys, thank you so much for watching. Be sure to stop by Temporal's page and give them a follow. Also, leave a like if you enjoyed the video. And if you're new to the channel, maybe check some videos out. And if you like them, maybe consider subscribing. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.